Good morning, guys. Good morning, guys. Oh, my voice. Today is Tuesday the 24th. It is 5.51. I'm here at the train station. Finally getting dropped off. Um, I'm going to commute into work today. And I'm going to take you guys along with me so you can see my commute. My train is coming in four minutes. So let me head upstairs. And I will see you guys on the train. and I'm gonna run to Zara. I got my backpack with all my stuff that I purchased that I need to exchange for smaller sizes and I'm gonna go to the larger one on Fifth Avenue. I used to go to the one on 63rd and Broadway but it's small and they don't have anything so I'm gonna take you guys with me. Hey guys, ooh that sun is hitting nice. Okay y'all, I did not take y'all in Zara because again, I'm going on my lunch hour. It was crowded in there. The returns line and exchanges. Okay, so first of all, let's talk while I'm walking in these New York City streets, right? <clears throat> have you ever had to, have you ever had to return something in Zara or exchange something? Oh my God. So I'm at the register and a young lady, everything that you return, they have to now put the alarms back on and they have to hang the items up so she's doing all of this with a sprint a sprint on her finger the line is hella long so i'm like girl teamwork can i help you while you put the alarms in let me just hang the stuff up for you she has to button it and everything y'all i could about died waiting for her to do all that oh my god of course they didn't have everything that i needed they had the top and the right size but then they didn't have the bottoms or they had the bottoms in the right size but then they didn't have the top it was just a mess and i went to the big one here on um fifth avenue and where am i 51st street because the one by my job i think i mentioned guys on 63rd and broadway <clears throat> it's smaller and they don't really have a lot of stuff and i didn't want to take my chances going there and being disappointed which 
I was a little disappointed with this one too, but I was able to replace an item too with something else that I found. Ooh, I am getting my steps in. So let me pay attention and I am headed back to work now. I got my little book bag on, all my stuff. So, t-shirt looks a little nervous, huh? It's like this. <clears throat> it is beautiful out here, guys. He all nosy looking back at my camera like, who she talking to? Not you. <laughs> Not you, boo. Boo ski. All right, y'all, let me focus before I bump into somebody and they get real mad. You know us New Yorkers, people say we so rude. We can be, not me, but New Yorkers can definitely be rude. So let me focus. Bye. day complete guys it's now 502 i'm gonna catch my 523 train i need to pick up my daughter's car first from my mom's house so that's where i'm headed and then i'm going to drive home today was actually a really good day i cannot complain i will not complain um so now time for me to take you guys on the train to commute with me back the way I'm going. Okay guys, so I just made it to my mom's house. Someone's getting on the elevator, mask up. Floor going up. <sighs> anyway guys, I have mask face, yuck. What are you fussing for? What you fussing for? Y'all to look at my mother's fiddly fig. So this is why I refuse to give up because this plant is absolutely beautiful. And Ma, you don't even have it directly in like the direct sun? Mine's is burning all over the tips. Oh, I probably shouldn't have touched the plant. Maybe that's what it is. Look at her monstera. And she has a banana plant. This one's not doing so well. What's this? I mean birds of paradise. Sorry. This one's growing. What's in there? Yeah. This monstera is nice. I'm sorry. I should not be touching your plants. 
You said you have one in the bedroom? Mm -hmm. Let's go see the one in the bed. I gave my mom a piece of this plant. You guys know I have it in my house. And look how crazy it's growing. This is just growing. This one looks good too. Another fiddly fig. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, I'm so jealous. I think I'm gonna just have to move mine out of the direct sun. Huh? Yep, it's beautiful. I love it. Y'all see this view? Here we go, y'all see that? Y'all, that is the, let me see if y'all can see it. Y'all probably can't see it, but that's the Tap and Bridge way back there somewhere this view is everything look at me and my baby look at me and my baby girl do y'all see me that is Lisette at 24 and a half years old look at those tifus look at that hair y'all I was a slave to the Dominican salon with that thick hair. Mommy, do you want lap? Do you want wash and say? Mira, Lise. Ven acá. Siéntate. Yeah, that was me, y'all. I couldn't do it. So I came down with the ball head crew.